Hi, my name is Leslie Moselle and we're here at Mickey Quinn's in Seminole, Florida. And on behalf of Expert Village, this is how to be a successful server. So we have our wine. You can place your cork here. Now, you want to go ahead and pour a little bit of the wine into the gentleman or the lady who has purchased the bottle of wine so that they can taste it. Now, you just want to pour just enough that they can get a good enough taste of the wine and let the customer taste it. This allows them to see if they enjoy if they enjoy the bottle of wine that it's a good tasting wine before you actually pour it out to the rest of the guests at the table. If they enjoy it, you let them taste it, they let you know, yes, it's good. Then what you want to do is you want to see, do you have women at the table? And if you have women at the table, then you want to pour the ladies first. You go ahead and you just pour. You don't want to fill the glasses too full with these glasses. That pretty much is enough. You want to make sure that you're not pouring too fast and that you pull the bottle away from the glass and not spill any of the wine. Once you've poured all the ladies, you can move on to the other gentleman at the table and you want to fill the person who purchased the wine last. You fill their guest first and then you fill theirs. You want to try to assure that everyone has the same amount of wine and that everybody's glass is pretty much full. And then you, if there's any left over, you just place the bottle of wine on the table if it's red and then in an ice bucket if it's, if it's a white wine to keep it chilled. But that's how you pour a bottle of wine.